This video presents curtain walls enhancements, with a focus on the updates regarding the editing mode. Select the curtain wall on the floor plan and click on the appearing edit button. You'll notice that this edit mode is already available from the floor plan. The curtain wall tools and the on-screen controls are also available for the floor plan and section view as well. Note, for access and exit, you can also use the design, enter or exit curtain wall edit mode menu command. Or just simply click the exit edit mode in the last row of the on-screen controls to exit. At the floor plan edit mode, you can choose from two appearances, projected or symbolic. Let's leave the edit mode and open the section view by using the section marker from the floor plan. Select the curtain wall here as well and then click the edit button. Change the floor plan, section, or 3D window in the tab bar. As you can see, we can remain in edit mode even when switching between views. In addition, when we hide the environment, only the edited elements can be seen in each view. The Grip Selection shortcut now enables you to select all the frames or panels along either the grid's rows or its columns, not just in 3D, but on the floor plan and section views as well. Switch to the floor plan. Let's select some panels on top of each other, for example, and press Delete to remove those. Look at the result in 3D. Switch to the section, select the lower horizontal frame, and press Delete to remove it. Select the upper frame, right-click and choose the Move Drag command, and then move the frames 500 mm lower. See the result in 3D. Note, if you exit from the editing mode, undo Q also supports individual sub-elements, so you can return to each operation made in the edit mode. Let's see a quick overview of some other improvements. Click the curtain wall settings on-screen control in the edit mode or open the settings of the selected curtain wall element via the info box. The settings dialogs interactions, functionality, terms, and user interface have also been updated. In the scheme preview, the panels show the correct surface color in accordance with the building materials. Also, the tooltip appears on the main and distinct panels. The library part user interface of curtain wall components has also been redesigned. A new tab page control is available for junctions and accessories for faster editing. The edit mode is now available in floor plan, section, and elevation. This makes it easier to create and edit curtain walls in any view, such as on the floor plan or section and elevation, not just in 3D.